Hello everybody, welcome back, I'm Mr. Red. Welcome back to an episode of Red Dead Redemption 2. Uh, so I'm over here in the Wapiti, yeah, the Wapiti uh, Indian Reservation over here to help out. I'm pretty sure it was a uh, rain's fall to kind of like talk to him. I'm pretty sure he needed some help or something or just to like talk, I'm not too sure. Uh, yeah, but we're here. Of course, in the last episode we stole like the explosives, I'm pretty sure it was. Yeah, it was the explosives. Uh, for another mission, I guess. I'm, pr I'm pretty sure it's the one uh, that is considered like the mini map, just actually not too far from here, uh, marked with John. So we're gonna have to like blow up some bridge or something. I'm not too sure. Uh, but yeah, it is actually not too far from here, actually on its way to this place. Uh, so I'm gonna prob probably do that in the next episode, just to kind of not have to like travel back here because it did take uh, quite some time. Uh, but for now, I guess let's get off the horse and look for Rain's fall over here. I'm guessing maybe he's in his tent. Uh, oh, in his. I sorry, don't know if it's his tent, but in this tent over here. Uh, let's check over here. Let's enter. Hello. Come in. <coughs> you don't sound very well. I'm not. I'm, I think I'm dying. Then I hope you find peace. I don't know too much about peace. Apparently not. Did you have fun with my son, the impetuous prince? I believe you went on a raid with him. Um, I'm sorry. I suppose I lack the grandeur of a conventional king. I don't know too many kings. <laughs> Colonel Favors, he has already exacted some measure of revenge for the raid. Two women were assaulted by his men. Um, I'm very sorry about all of this. Yes. Sometimes the correct path, the bravest path, is the least obvious and also the gentlest. I'm, I'm a great disappointment to my son. Your son seems to want a war. My son thinks there is glory in death. Maybe he's right, but for me, I saw death being handed out so freely by the most foolish of men, I never could equate it with victory. Glory has come in service. Maybe. Maybe not, I don't know. I've killed a lot of people. For a whole lot of dumb reasons, and I ain't never seen much glory in it. Well, your friend, Mr. Vanderland, he talks a lot. I don't know him, but my son is easily lit. I'm not sure I get you. Uh, well, perhaps we could go for a ride. I'm an old man. My whole life I have tried to bring peace. But uh, I ain't doing so good. Then maybe you can take pity on my plight. Please, it won't take long. <coughs> and maybe I can help you with that cough. Sir! Hmm. I'm glad I caught you, sir. Captain Monroe, do you know my friend, Mr. Morgan? No, sir. I don't have the pleasure. Arthur Morgan. It's an honor, sir. How can I help you, Captain? I was just in San Denis. I spoke with the mayor. It's not good news, I'm afraid. May I ride with you for a little? Of course. Okay, so, uh, was this guy Captain Monroe, was it? I'm not, I'm not really sure if I call his name well. I'm pretty sure it was Monroe. Or was it someone else? I'm not too sure. I guess we're going to see when he starts talking in, like, the subtitles at the bottom. That's where I kind of have him on. Just kind of get to know people's names. Oh, yeah, it was Captain Monroe, okay. So let's kind of listen to what they've got to say. the mayor and the Bureau of Indian Affairs in San Denis at length. But regrettably, it appears the oil company has already received approval to move forward with drilling on the reservation's land. I suppose there's much. So what does that mean for us now? I'm not sure just yet. I didn't get the impression anything would be happening for a few months. I'm very sorry, sir. I did everything I could. I know, Captain. And I assure you I will continue to do as much as I can. Mr. Morgan, would you have time to help me at all? I would rather certain actions were taken by friends outside the tribe. 
Well, I guess Raids 4 was kind of talking about like finding peace, so I guess we can sure, help and kind of that could That's count as do. peace. I'm not too sure. Thank you. So yeah, I guess Come we can help them. I'm not really sure if this is going to be like a main story mission uh, with this guy or if it's going to be like a side like mission. Uh, if it is going to be a side mission, then I guess we're not going to do it because I kind of I've got like ideas for like different videos and stuff, but I want to get this done first before I start anything else. I have some other business to attend to, Mr. Morgan. We'll continue on this way. I'm going to look for some herbs to give you. Okay, so I guess let's follow Raids for over here. Talk about some herbs that can give me to kind of help with this cough that Arthur has got. It ain't pretty. Uh, so I guess follow him up here. There is quite cool mountains over here, isn't there? Mortality and beauty are both all around us. Yet so often we're unable to see past our own grievances. This is what I try to teach my son. Okay. Oh, oh, that is really bad, was it? That? Okay, I'm pretty sure that was actually not like part of the mission. I'm pretty sure they just like sometimes spawn wherever they spawn wherever they can go. We can talk if you want, Mr. Morgan, but don't feel like you have to. It's a beautiful ride ahead if you need some time to think. Okay, so I guess let's go. I'm not really sure if I could have talked to him before or if I could just talk to him now, but let's ask about like eagle flies, I guess. So, we don't know each other too well, but I wanted to speak to you about your son. I was there on the raid to steal back those horses and, uh, well, you know something of Dutch, I think. Yes. A little. Mostly from your friend Charles. I don't know why Dutch is getting involved in your situation. And Sorry, uh, hold up a moment. That'll have to wait. Some of the plants I need will be growing down here. Okay, I guess we can go You're off there. The wrong way. I'm pretty sure this, this is a bit bugged, I'm pretty sure, because I couldn't really go that far. And, well, because of that, I... We were apparently going the wrong way, but we kept, we're clearly not. We're just following him over here. Uh, so, I don't know. Let's, let's keep on following him. Maybe it will sort itself out. If not, I'm going to have to restart it like, like I had to on, on, on the kind of like uh, back on the island of Guam. But we had to like reset the mission to kind of get it to properly work. This ain't easy to say. But I just don't trust that he's got your son's best interests at heart. So what can we do? I don't rightly know. Charles and I just thought you should be aware. Maybe there's a way to stop things from getting any more out of control. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Let me give this some thought. Okay, uh... Arthur's son. Uh, I'm not Be really careful. sure what that's all about, but I guess let's let's talk about that. Ahead, but the views are if I can. Up here. <laughs> you know, okay, there you go. I think Alpha's going to talk about it. Once, years ago. Don't talk about him much. Oh, what was his name? Isaac. His mother, Eliza, the waitress I met. When she got pregnant... She she knew who I was, what my life was. I didn't want to promise nothing I couldn't keep, but I said I'd do right by them. Every few months, I'd stop by there for a few days. He was such a good kid. Wait, stop here. Oh, I come on, we're just going to stop by like a million times. Because uh, Rainsfall's going to pick up his herbs and stuff, do his weekly, sh weekly shopping over here. Here's a really, really cool view from here. I'm this not really sure if we can kind well. of see what we can kind of see from here, like what side of the map. I'm pretty sure that might be a... Uh, what do you call it? What do you call it? I'm pretty sure that should be uh, Saint Denis over there. 
Wait there. It does I'll look like it, does that. Okay. Let's jump on a horse then, if we can. There's I guess we gotta wait. It tastes awful, but it'll help to keep your strength up. Okay. okay All right, let's go. I guess we can do that some other time, maybe not right now. Now, I was saying, he was such a good kid. She was too, I guess. <laughs> Just a kid, 19. What happened? I got there one day and saw two crosses Ooh. outside. I knew right away. Turned out some bastards had come through. Robbed them. Shot them dead. And offered ten dollars. It hardened me. Feeling that kind of pain. But I know now that you don't get to live a bad life and have good things happen to you. I think you're being hard on yourself. Maybe. All I can do now is try and make some things right. Well, I guess I never knew about that. I guess we're we're learning something new. Uh, let's ask about Monroe then. Like, why is he helping them so much and, and stuff? Monroe, how you know him? Captain Monroe was reassigned here from a regiment in the north. Apparently, the news of our conflict has spread all the way to Washington. He's a good man. He wants to help. Well, I guess that's something, at least. The army aren't all bad men. Just as my people aren't all good. But this Colonel Favors, he walks an old line. He's obstinate, and he hates Monroe. I just hope between us we can work this out. Okay, that's kind of interesting then. I guess he has help, so that's good. So we can maybe help him out if there's like a main story mission. If if you had like really good binoculars in this game, like you could probably spot our camp from here. If it's not here, then behind like trees and stuff. But we could probably see it because it is it's like in between ahead. us and Saint Denis right now. There is quite a lot of trees over there, but yeah, I guess we could kind of spot it a bit. No, so what's, what's going on up here? No! They destroyed everything! No, I need to find the Chinupa. Who, who would do this? Someone who wanted to enrage you. Help me look around. Please! The Chinupa is gone. Okay, sure, we can kind of help. I'm not really sure what we are looking for exactly. There's quite a lot of stuff, so let's, uh, let's check. There must be some clues to what happened here. Oh, come on, what, where, are, where am I going? Okay, I guess we're walking over here. What? <laughs> Am I literally just going to walk all the way around here just to kind of check this? Apparently I am. I was already over here, but I've just walked around just to inspect this over here. I guess that's what kind of started the fire too, like, what kind of made it so big. And there was something over here too to kind of check, so let's check this out. Some kind of flask or something. Oh, okay, there it is. There's some whiskey here. More over okay. Here. Let's continue on. Okay. I'm not really sure where we're going, but and I guess let's go to Rainsfall over here. Bottle of whiskey. Well, if they drank all that, they couldn't have gotten too far. Yeah, well, still no sign of the Chinupa. There is some more smoke down there. I'm not really sure if that's kind of to do with this, to do with this fire over here, but I'm not too sure. Let's keep on looking around here, I guess. There's another clue over here, another flask over here. Oh, yeah, there it is. Sure looks like they was doing some drinking. Okay. Yep. Okay. I, I guess we gotta go up here now. Thank you. Mr. Morgan. 
Oh, there's like a camp down there. Okay, that's where the spokes come in from. Have any binoculars? Yes, we do. Okay, let's zoom in and check what's kind of oh, going on over there. Are. These brave men. Some of Colonel Favor's men. They must have been the ones who did this. Are you surprised this happened? Not at all. But... But I hope we were past this. Well, you got land they want. Land with oil. They moved us here. They've taken everything we had. I signed three treaties myself, and they've broken each one. Yeah, that doesn't sound too, no, too nice. Does it? No, my people are going to want a war. I guess that's Whenever what they, they kind of want, win. because they want to like enrage them, make them fight, and kind of take them up for good. Get it back. Get it back? Yeah, I'm gonna go in, get your chin up, and no one will be any the wiser. Would you do that? Well, you can't go. They know why you'd come. I, uh... Don't have any money. No, I don't need your money. Okay, so I guess we're going to the camp down there. I'm not really sure if we can take our horse or something. Our sacred items. Uh, I whistled for it. Is it coming? Yeah, okay, there it is. I'll try to it is, sure that they it is quite far away, so... Uh, might as well just get on my horse over here, just to get it... Just to get there a bit faster. And, you know, just in case I'm going to have all my guns on me. Just in things turn kind of... Uh, in, just in case things turn south. Because they might. So we might as well just kind of get ready for anything. So do I want, like... Any weapons with me, I guess we can take the Springfield rifle and uh, the double barreled shotgun, why not? Should definitely make things a lot easier just in case we kind of get into some mess over here. There we go. Okay. Let's get off over here. Because now we kind of want to stay sneaky, don't we? And kind of walking it on a horse isn't gonna be too sneaky. Okay, so I can kind of see where where they're facing on the map, like always. So first of all, we kind of just want to get down there without being spotted, which we should be able to do. Okay, is anyone looking this way? Ah, uh, can sneak past. Who wants to fight them? Cares. Okay, we just need to slowly, slowly make our way over here. Anyway, Not really sure where it should be or where it could be. Uh, there's a guy down there. Can we like take them out? Like, What's not take them. Huh? Oh, not go over there. Come on. Hey, I heard oh no, you didn't. Huh? Oh, this is gonna be quite bad, isn't it? Oh, yep, it is going to be bad. I kind of knew it would turn to this, but I kind of didn't want to, but... Oh, it is going to turn to this, isn't it? We kind of, we kind of do need to take them out now, don't we? Because if not, they're going to take us out, which, which isn't going to be that good, is it? Oh, we need to break free over here. Oh, come on, down here. Okay, there you go. Just two more left, I'm pretty sure. Okay, let's get the pistol out. Oh, if I can even... Okay, there you go. And the last guy over here. There you go. Okay, that was nice. Oh, something's on fire over there. Let's get our hat back. Okay. Now we can kind of search for it in peace, I guess. Our horses are spooked, of course. Uh, the table's on fire, okay. Horses are really spooked. Come on, calm down. Okay. Oh, something over here, is it there? Oh, what is it? Oh, okay, it's over here. What does it look like? Oh, it's this over here. Okay, that's... It's cool that we found it. I'm not really sure if we could have, like, found it without... Without fighting them, because it was, like, right in the middle of their camp, so... I'm not really sure if it could have turned out any other way. 
for all I know is that we got it, but now we can go back to Rain's Fall, return the items over there, and I guess carry on with the mission. So let's get up here, it's not going to take too long. Oh, <laughs> it's going to take a bit longer if I bump into all the trees on the way. Uh, but there you go, we're already at the top over here. Yep. Definitely takes it yeah. definitely takes it like quite a lot faster by horse and just like walking everywhere. But we're over here. I'm not really sure where he is, I guess he's kinda of just looking at the stuff that's kind of left. Me you found it. Yep, we we did find it. It did kinda of cost hey. some lives, but we did I, uh, we do have it. I got your things, I think. Yes. Thank you. I'm very sorry about this. Even sacred things are only things. People, the heart, matter more. Was anyone hurt? Yes. It's a bad business. I should not have let you do this for me, but perhaps it will stop a bigger massacre. With these, maybe I can calm my people. Maybe I can calm my son. I hope so. Thank you. Take those herbs I gave you, please. And most of all, I hope you can find peace within yourself. He's a man who... Not so long ago, I would have found weak and pathetic. Now I see as wise and thoughtful and sensible. I would love to help him, or at least stop Dutch pushing his son to do something real stupid. Okay, so there you go, that mission is over. Uh, just a bronze medal this time. We did get quite a couple of silvers. I'm pretty sure we never got the gold though, but that's like quite a lot harder. Uh, so around here we did like the the kind of legendary bear, so we got to watch out for that. Uh, but oh no, it actually is like a main story mission with Captain Monroe over there. Uh, so we need to help over there. I'm not really sure if we're going to go there straight away or if we're going to do this uh, mission with John over here, the bridge to nowhere. And then also we have this mission all the way down here in San Denis with Sadie but I think we're gonna leave that until we're kind of like back at camp or like close to like this area because we're traveling there for one mission then returning for two isn't going to make too much sense but I guess for now I hope you guys enjoyed like share subscribe and I'll see you guys next time bye bye